the dining area, plenty of room to fit eight people. It's, it's literally almost bigger than my bedroom. It's like you got a lot of sunlight. Definitely, I would love to come and check out once it's done. <laughs> love this one, man. I'm tempted to buy something. <laughs> so, here's what you can get in Windsor Essex for 1.5 million. And it's like massive inside. It's like 3,100 ish square footage. And plus another 1,500 basement. Double car garage with a covered porch in the back. A lot of details. So let's find out the details about the project and let's tour this $1.5 million home. Of course, it's under construction, but let's see it out. Take a real close look now. Uh -uh. Soon you'll realize you don't know what's coming down. I got you hypnotized. Take a real close look now. I'm going to show you how. My name's Alex Armstrong. I'm a real estate agent at Royal LePage. Uh, my family's been uh, in the business for three generations, over wow. 50 years. You know, my grandfather sold real estate and uh, my father still sells real estate. Um, so I'm happy to carry on the tradition. Mm -hmm. uh, I typically work out in the county, you know, Essex, Cottom, Kingsville, that sort of yeah. area. This is a beautiful two-story home, 3,200 square feet mm -hmm. built by Castor Custom. He's a local builder, been building for over 25 years and he makes a very nice product. Perfect, I'm definitely excited. So uh, tell us a little bit more about the project that you have available right now. For sure. Uh, so the project that I have, uh, there's 40 homes going into it. 20 of those are semi-detached units. Okay. Uh, another 21 uh, are the detached homes. Detached, okay. We're already sold out, 25% sold out on the semis. Okay. Uh, and we've only got five uh, detached homes remaining. So oh, so it's, just probably another 75 of uh, semis and uh, five detached. So can you give us an idea uh, on uh, what's the detached uh, price point, a semi-detached price point, and what's the price point for detached? For sure. So the semi-detached, there's 1,627 square foot uh, bungalows, mm -hmm. two bed, two bath, uh, set up with a master suite. Price point there is uh, 849 uh, That includes, 849 mm -hmm. Exactly. That includes a concrete drive and yeah. a fully sodded yard. Okay, so pretty much like ready to move in. Exactly. You're walking in. Got it. And is it like a, a, a regular finishes or is it luxury finishes? It's fairly premium finishes throughout there. You've got nine foot ceilings mm -hmm. and trade ceilings in the living room, the master and the kitchen. Mm -hmm. uh, you've got architectural trim, uh, glass and tile showers, yep. uh, a large 15 by 10 covered porch. And the, yeah. the biggest thing I think is uh, the lot size. Um, you're 158 feet deep for your lot. 158? That's right. No neighbors wow. right in your backyard. You've got some wow. space. Wow, that, that's huge. Bigger than my lot. <laughs> so, uh, what is it for investors, you know, um, you know, because a lot of my clients are investors, a lot of, you know, people who watch these videos are investors. What's the deposit structure? What's the expected closing date for this project? Absolutely. So the deposit structure is a total of $40,000, which is phenomenal for our area. So that's it, like just 40000 is what I'm paying. Until you uh, get the keys. That's right. Which is like less than 5%. Yes. Close to 5%. Yeah. And how, how long do I have to pay that? Like as soon as I have an offer accepted or? So it's staggered. Mm -hmm. uh, there's different stages. So when you uh, have a signed purchase agreement, mm -hmm. it'll be $10,000 uh, for the first deposit. Once we start digging the foundation, another okay. 10. Okay. And then once the roof is complete, your final 20. Wow. That's that's a pretty good one. I I haven't heard that kind of deposit structure because generally in Toronto area and other cities, you know, they, they ask for like first 5% in first 30 days exactly, and uh, another 5% in like next 90 days. This is pretty cool. Well, and, and another nice thing too is the assignment clause is already standard in the oh, agreement. Oh, so you don't have to pay any extra fees for assignment. Uh, so there, there is a fee to it. Mm -hmm. um, there, it's a $5,000 assignment fee. Okay, so only if you pay that if you assign. Correct. Okay, and when is the closing date? We're expecting February 2023. Oh, February 2023. So pretty much like you got another one year. And what's the starting price for the detached? So for the detached, uh, we've got varying price points. We've got a 2,150 square foot bungalow that starts at 1.15. Oh, wow. We've got a 2,600 square foot uh, two-story 
and that starts at 1.25. 1.25. And wow. then the 3,200 square foot, like what we're in, yeah, that starts at 1.5. 1.5, wow. wow. Yeah, just give us a tour, like, you know, tell us what kind of finishes we're going to get in this 1.5 million. Absolutely. I'm curious. Stone for the fireplace. Yeah, there will be a nice mantle on, on that as well, mm -hmm. under the TV. So, um, what's the size of the kitchen? Where is where the kitchen going to be laid out? Exactly. So, how the kitchen layout is going to look, you're going to have cabinetry on two walls, uh, mm -hmm. this wall here, and then also uh, around the window, that's where your sink will be. You're going to have a beautiful nine foot island. Oh, wow. Uh, all the way through there. And my favorite part is the size of the walk in pantry. Uh, Caster Custom really finish, finishes off their homes nice. There's no wire uh, shelving in that pantry. He has it uh, just like your kitchen cabinets out mm -hmm. that everybody sees. That's how it looks in the pantry. Also, it looks like a cabinet, but you open the door and it's like pantry. Beautiful. Wow. And, and the dining area? Correct. This is the dining area. Plenty wow. of room to fit eight people. Uh, you can see that we've got the trade ceiling. Biggest thing what I really love is like those big windows. You can literally see the backyard. Absolutely. While you're having the dinner and lots of sunlight comes into the house. The windows are massive. Another nice thing that we can do is we can change out this window here and instead of having a, a, a side door like that, mm -hmm. you can put a sliding patio. So you can just go directly onto the patio. Exactly. And that, that's my favorite part. <laughs> Let's take on the back. Sure, we can check out the patio. Wow, this is nice. Nice. So we have a beautiful patio area uh, right here in our model home. Uh, we actually have some neighbors behind us. However, in the Cottoms uh, development, it's going to be open fields for acres. And uh, for the semi detached we just talked, they can, they do get this closed patio. They get a similar patio, that's right. And kind of similar size? Uh, similar size, 15 wow. by 10. 15 by 10. That's pretty good size like for a closed patio. Absolutely. Uh, the setup here is really nice too because you can easily put in two windows on either side of the fireplace mm -hmm. and you can have a retractable screen come down and you've got a beautiful kind of three season area. So on the semi-detached they even get the fireplace too? It is an option. We can put in a fireplace. Oh, okay, but they do build this area. Love this one, man. I'm tempted to buy one something. <laughs> so, on the main floor, we got one office, living, kitchen, and a power room. And, right. and how many bedrooms do we get upstairs? So upstairs, we get four bedrooms total. Uh, there's, of course, a master suite set up with a walk-in closet and, you know, an ensuite. Uh, we have it set up, this particular home, with a fairly large laundry room. Yep. However, we can change it up so that you have three full baths on the second, God, the second floor. Yeah, so let's go take a look upstairs. So do they have an option like um, for the bungalows that they're looking at, of course they don't have the second floor, uh, but for detached, uh, do we have an option to get the glass printing? Exactly, you can have whatever style of railing you'd like, uh, you know, if you wanted, um, you know, glass instead of spindles, we can mm -hmm. absolutely, absolutely do that. Uh, if you'd like, you know, all wood banisters, we can do that. It's whatever your look is. Yeah, yeah, sounds good. Um, you want to start with the plaster? I think we should start with the plaster. So flooded with natural light, we're up here in the front of the house, wow. so absolutely massive windows. Modern style too, uh, and they're not all fixed, you can actually open these ones, which is uh, very nice. He got, he got the, the one cool thing I love about his design is like he got a lot of sunlight. Big windows, even in the living area, the dining area, absolutely. Uh, here. So what I can see there, something huge. So. This is the bedroom. This is where the bed will go. And down the hall here, we'll have what almost seems like another bedroom, uh, but it's actually the walk-in closet. Wow. And he'll set it up uh, with a California closet style. You could actually put a little uh, like pedestal in the middle here for you know your changing and uh, you want it to. Yeah, this is like 16 by eight or something. It's massive. It's, it's literally almost bigger than my bedroom. Maybe my bedroom is like 10 by 12. This is even... <laughs> well, we'll add the bathroom and then we've got it. Eh? Following down the hall here, he's got a beautiful, a beautiful ensuite bath. Definitely, I would love to come and check out once it's done. I agree, I agree. This doesn't do it justice yet, but you can see he's got his uh, the start of the tiled shower going in. There will be an architectural so nice glass. glass. Yeah, and then you have a tub. 
Exactly, a soaker tub here with a chandelier. Wow. You've got double vanity, of course your water closet. And then massive. Your water closet. <laughs> yeah, this is massive. So you said like the main floor is 1,530 square feet? Yes. And the upstairs is like 1,600. Uh, right, right around there. Yeah, yeah for 1.5 million, 3,100 square feet. And we have a almost same 1,500 square feet in the basement. Correct. And if they haven't, if they want, is there a potential to make it uh, like a great, uh, great entrance? There is, and uh, that can be either in the garage, inside, mm -hmm. uh, wherever you'd like. Okay, so of course it's, uh, it comes with extra cost on top of it if you want to do it. It does, but <laughs> it's, it's reasonable. Yeah, okay, sounds good. So if we carry on down the hall here. So we got one another full washroom. Correct. For the extended kits. So this end of the home is where our three bedrooms uh, are located. They're very generous bedrooms. Uh, sizable, almost like a double closet in here. Yeah. Now we don't have any of the trim uh, on the home. However, uh, you can get it finished off with crown molding all throughout. Um, recessed lighting, of course. Nice, and they got pot lights everywhere. Yes, he's a, he's a pot light fanatic, that's, that's for sure. Yeah, that's what I feel like everywhere the pot lights are running. The nice thing about Castor Custom as well is he doesn't nickel and dime you. Uh, the pot lights are included. Everything you see pot light wise in here is included in the one point. So pot. even for the semi detached that we are talking about the, the pre construction, um, they do have all these finishes included, like uh, the kitchen granite countertop. So in the semi-detached, it's all stone counters uh, stone for counters. the kitchen as well as the bathrooms. What's the flooring? Uh, the flooring is engineered hardwood uh, yeah. and then porcelain, oh, wow. of course, in the uh, bathrooms. Wow, so except the fireplace, pretty much rest everything in appliances? Uh, appliances are not included, but we will help you install them. Okay, that's fantastic. So, okay, sounds good. And just off to our right here, we have our third bedroom, fourth bedroom at the end of the hall. And here's our massive laundry uh, that I was massive telling you about. Massive laundry, yeah. Oh my God, this is huge. <laughs> Absolutely. So what we can do is we can run a wall through here and fit in another full another bath. Another washroom, yeah. Exactly. I, if I were the buyer, I would definitely do that because I don't need this much space. Or maybe squeeze in a full washroom within the laundry area. Absolutely. So that way you got another washroom. So yeah, that's fantastic. Alex, I, I really appreciate for this tour and definitely looking forward for completion tour. We'll have to have you back once it's complete. Yes, so when do you think this project will be done? I think we're probably another three months or so away. Okay, perfect. So once, please, please give me a shout. And also if any projects like this come up, send it my way because I have a lot of people who are interested in those, you know, uh, and, and you know, if anyone interested, definitely I'll, I'll give you a shout. Um, I really appreciate it, man. Thank Absolutely. you. Absolutely, thank you. Yeah, take it. Guys, so hope you enjoyed the tour. And if you're interested in those semi-detached, if you would like to know more details, send me a DM, send me a DM on Instagram or Facebook, or send us an email in the description, phone number, give us a call, we'll go from there. Until then, check out the other videos. See you later.